I've been doing a series of showcase professional videos and this video is going to be concentrating on material substitution. So in this case we're using an inventor data set but really the data could have come from any form of CAD file or uh, alias wire file. And inside of inventor each one of the parts has been materialized. We're going to allow Showcase to replace the imported materials and you'll notice on the left side we have all the, the complete listing of the Inventor materials. We're going to look for one of the materials and as we select the material the product itself that the material is assigned to is going to change. In our list we're going to find the red leather or the black leather and we're going to change that part to a black leather. It automatically updates inside the window. Next, we're going to go to the handlebar, or the handle grips. And on that, they're supposed to be blue, but we're going to grab a black for now. We're going to change that later. And then finally, we're going to hit the tire and um, very simply assign a material to that. Another feature of the replace imported materials is a mapping function. Inside of the CAD package, if you're careful with the naming, and consistent with the naming, you can automatically substitute the name of the material inside of the CAD package into the showcase material. And that's what this list gives you. So now as we hit the mapped button, you'll notice that all of the materials that are in the imported material list that matches inside of that list that I just showed you will automatically be changed over to the showcase materials within the session itself. So that's the conclusion of the material mapping inside a Showcase Professional.